So in this next example, I want you to watch very carefully this little bit of video and see if you can hear what I'm saying. So watch this. Ba ba, ba ba, ba ba. What did you hear? Who heard da da? Put your hand up if you heard that. Okay, if you're sitting in the middle, let's try it again. Ba ba, ba ba, ba ba. What did you hear? Da da, especially in the middle section only. What did you hear? Da, da da. Da ba. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Let's make this easier. This time, I want you to listen again, but close your eyes. Okay. Listen again. Ba ba, ba ba, ba ba. What did you hear this time? Ba. Definitely, it was ba. If you heard da, then you were being fooled by the illusion called the McGurk effect, because I'm not actually mouthing ba ba or da da. What I'm actually mouthing is ga ga. And so the brain gets the signal of ga, and it's hearing ba, but these are patterns that's never encountered before, and it comes up with a solution, which is da. So your brain's always trying to interpret experiences to come up with the best solution. Now, this way, when you're watching people speak, you watch their mouths moving, and the shape of their mouths can actually influence what you think you're hearing. So here's a very simple party trick you can try. I want you to turn to the person next to you, and I want you to mouth the words, Elephant juice. Don't say it, just say elephant juice and just mouth it. Turn to the person next to you. What does it sound like? What, does it, what, what do you think the person might be saying? Why are you laughing? Okay, okay. Does it look like the person could be saying, does it look like I love you? Do I hear I love you? I love you all. Wouldn't the world be a greater place if everyone said elephant juice a little bit more often to each other?